Amazon's lineup of Fire tablets are fantastic for anyone looking to add a reliable budget tablet to their home, and it's particularly great for kids. From the $50 Fire 7 all the way up to the $150 Fire HD 10, Amazon's tablets are perfect first devices for the messy, unpredictable lives of children, especially when you look at the kids-specific devices Amazon offers. Of course, there's one small problem with the Fire tablet. Despite running a forked version of Android, it doesn't include any of Google's apps. That includes the Play Store, and more importantly, YouTube Kids, an incredibly popular app trusted by parents around the world to keep kids safe while watching videos online. An offshoot of YouTube's normal app, YouTube Kids allows you to ensure your child is only accessing kid-friendly content on the world's biggest video sharing network. If you're trying to install YouTube Kids on your Fire tablet, you aren't out of luck. Getting the app on your Fire tablet is possible, but not without some limitations. Let's start with the installation process. Installing the app isn't as easy as just running an APK installation file on your device. First, you'll need to get the Google Play Store up and running on your tablet. This process isn't complicated or time consuming, but it does have a few steps you'll wanna pay attention to as you install the required APKs onto your device. We have a whole guide for installing the Play Store on your Fire tablet that we suggest you check out if you haven't already, as installing the Play Store is a necessary step for getting YouTube Kids up and running on your device. Make sure you check that video out, because depending on which Fire tablet you have, the files you need to install may differ. Once you have the Play Store installed on your device and you've logged into your Google account, you can search the Play Store for YouTube Kids to install it onto your device. The app runs, more or less, exactly how you would expect on a normal Android tablet, but there's a catch. The app won't run on a child profile on your Fire tablet. This has been a problem going on all the way back to the fall of 2017, and it continues to be a restriction implemented by Amazon. This is unfortunate, since free time is a useful tool for parents looking to curtail the apps their children use on the device. If child locks are essential for your family, you'll need to find a workaround for your tablet. Thankfully, you now have the full power of the Play Store installed on your device, which means you can install a number of apps to help control the experience for your child, even outside of the normal child profile. The one you sign up for is really up to you, but we have a few of our favorites listed in the description below. Norton App Lock is one of the best, since it can add pin and password locks to the apps on your device, helping to ensure that your children aren't accessing applications that are unsafe or contain private information. Google Family Link can help keep an eye on your kids' screen time, manage their applications, view their activity, and even lock the device remotely making it ideal for parents who want to ensure that the tablet is being used responsibly. Finally, if you just want a simple screen time lock, screen time parental control can go a long way in helping to ensure your child is only using the device in the allotted time they're allowed. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Amazon's Fire tablets and other technology. And do not forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.